Hello all. A lot of trouble with fire these days around the world. Because of climate change, we're seeing all kinds of droughts around the world, especially here in the U.S. We're practically fully droughted out. But here in California, we always have a fire season. And just like all the other years, we have a major fire going right now called the Oak Fire. 16,700 acres burning, 3,000 people evacuated, 2,500 people fighting the fire. Now what makes this fire so unusual isn't the location, the foothills of the Sierra Mountains. It's the way the fire is burning. It's burning like liquid like liquid oil or a gasoline fire. It, uh, the whole forest just goes up all at once and it's just burning like liquid. And the, uh, it's very dangerous for people to be in there trying to fight these fires because they can be overwhelmed and overtaken so quickly. The undergrowth is dying out because of the drought situation. So you have a lot of dry underbrush, which is, is just lighting up like uh, fuel, like uh, gasoline. And Gavin Newsom, our, our governor, has declared the whole county of Mariposa a disaster area. Now, unfortunately, these type of fires are being seen all over the world. In the UK, where it's rarely ever above 80 degrees, in parts of Spain, parts of Europe, all over the place, we're seeing these liquefied fires, and they're really out of control. It's so important that we try and get climate change under control, because unfortunately, they're burning up houses and and, and buildings like they're nothing there like they just overwhelm and burn it up and it's gone and that means more resources are needed to rebuild and that's another problem is people are building in vulnerable places like the foothills of the Sierra Mountains they shouldn't be building there because they know sooner or later fire will engulf that area fire is a natural process that happens in the Sierra Mountains especially in the foothills. It's so unfortunate that people think they need to build in the forest because they really shouldn't. Whether it be floods or fire, it's just not the place to build. And sooner or later, a disaster, a natural disaster will come. And then, of course, the insurance companies will have to pay for it. And then your insurance goes up and up and up. And sooner or later, the state has to start making available insurance through the state, and then your taxes go up and up and up. People shouldn't be building in vulnerable fire locations, such as the Sierra Foothills. So, we'll keep an eye out on this and see what happens. But as the summer goes on, fire season goes on. And the drier it gets, the worse it gets. The more drought, the more fires. And unfortunately, climate change is rearing its ugly head worse and worse day by day. I appreciate your comments on this, your ups, the new subscribers, and your comments. I always appreciate them and always, uh, always read them. And until next time.